By simply taking a few minutes to relax, you can lower your heart rate, blood pressure, decrease your stress hormone activity, increase blood flow to muscles, increase your brain's ability to function, and even improve your memory. So why don't people relax more often? I know that it can be difficult to schedule time with everything that's bombarding our minds on a regular basis. So in this video, I'm going to help you by sharing five simple techniques that you can use to relax within minutes. All right, number one reading. Picking up a good book to lose yourself in can be a wonderful way to release stress, to learn, and to even improve your ability to relate with others. If you get into a flow, I'd encourage you to keep it going if you can. If not, maybe you end up getting a quick nap out of it. Number two, exercise. I know that it might seem like something that might stress you out. It can be hard to motivate yourself to get out and exercise sometimes, but even just going on a nature walk, getting outside, can really help your body release endorphins to help relieve your stress. If you have time, take a bath afterwards to continue relaxing. On the other hand, if you're feeling super energetic and up to the challenge, go for it. Do some kind of physical activity to get yourself moving and try to expend that built-up energy. I personally find that going on a run can help me clear my mind. Number three, be present. Slow down, take a deep breath, and really be in the moment. Engage with your senses. How does your food taste if you're on a lunch break? Does your face feel tense? What does your environment look like? What are you smelling? Do you have perfume on? Take time to realize that you are actually living in this moment. The next time that you have a conversation with someone, try really listening to what they're saying, even if it's hard. Just try taking a moment to slow down and take things one step at a time. Okay, on to number four, be grateful. Take some time to think about what you have to be grateful for. Listen to some good songs to help you get into a good mood if you need to. Think of the people or pets that you have in your life that you just feel so lucky to have and embrace that moment. I know it can be hard sometimes if you're in a rough spot, but try to look at the positives of the situation or look forward and think, okay, I know I'm at a low right now, but that just means that I can only go up from here. Stop yourself and acknowledge that you want to move forward with your life. Take time to think about all that you have going for you and keep in mind your dreams of how far you can take that. Lastly, we have number five, feel your emotions. It's important to dream big and give yourself that sense of purpose. But if you're feeling down, don't beat yourself up about it. If you don't take time to relax from your busy life, chances are that you might be neglecting your emotions and they might be building up from within. Find a quiet place where you can be alone and take a moment to be sad, cry, embrace that feeling so that you can do the healing that you need to do in order to properly move forward. The more that you practice these techniques, the easier it will become for you to relax as well as be able to take on your day with a clear, healthy mind. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.